In May, I introduced bipartisan legislation with Joe Barton to strengthen privacy safeguards for children and teenagers. A uh, bill, the Do Not Track Kids Act, would update the Children's Online Privacy Protection Act for the 21st century to cover newer applications and services like geolocation technologies that didn't exist when um, we passed the Children's Privacy Act 13 years ago uh, that I was the author of. Uh, that bill is the communications constitution when it comes to protecting kids online, but we need to amend it. Uh, to take into account the explosive growth and innovation in the online ecosystem uh, since 1998. 1998 was way back in the BF era, the before Facebook era. And in addition to uh, that law, our bill also contains common sense protections for teenagers. Uh, our bill's digital marketing bill of rights stipulates that websites, online apps, operators, and operators of mobile apps directed to teens clearly explain why they need to collect the data. Our bill also prohibits operators from collecting geolocation in information without permission from parents of, uh, when we're talking about children. And it finally includes an eraser button. Uh, and that's an important privacy protection which requires operators of websites or online applications that contain or display personal information about children or minors to enable users to erase or otherwise eliminate publicly available personal information on a website about children. I would hope that the least that we can accomplish this year is to provide a privacy bill of rights for children in our country. We can see now what the implications are uh, if that information gets hacked. Uh, and my hope is that we can update the 1999 law to accomplish that goal.